So what's up guys I am Sam and I am back with a new video and today's video is going to be very amazing as today I am going to tell you and show you a new time machine which is going to add in the summertime saga game. So as you can see this is the time machine which will be added in the tech update. So I will tell you everything about this time machine so watch the video till end. Before that if you are new to my channel make sure to subscribe our channel and also press the bell icon to never miss our new videos and also like this video. So as you guys know that the next update in the summertime saga game is going to be the tech update. For that DC is changing all the old backgrounds to the new backgrounds uh, which is going to be in the wide screen as the tech update is going to be in a wide screen. And also I have shown you many new wide screen backgrounds in my previous video. If you don't know you can check out my playlist. I have made a separate playlist on the tech update leak so you can watch it on the i button. So recently DC was working on Miss Okita's. Uh, office as we know Miss Okita is a science classroom teacher in Somerville High School and also main character has helped Miss Okita in doing various experiments so if you haven't completed the Miss Okita's walkthrough you can complete it and then you will know what kind of experiment main character has completed with Miss Okita so in the current version when we go to Miss Okita's office which is on the third floor as we can see we have to first uh, take the passcode so let's enter the passcode and when we go inside we can see in the current version the hoppies looks like this and as this is not a wide screen but from the tech update we are going to see a wide screen so for that DC has drawn a new background for Miss Okita's hoppies where we can see he has added a new time machine. So as we can see this is the new background location or we can say a new wide screen background for Miss Okita's hoppies. As the time machine is added in Miss Okita's hoppies, it uh, looks like we are going to see a new quest in Miss Okita's storyline or we have to do an experiment with that time machine and as we know the use of time machine is to go back in past or to go in future or we can time travel in it as the game creator have not told anything about the story of this time machine but we can make a theory. There can be two theories of this time machine let me tell you. The first theory is uh, the main character will go inside that time machine and he will go back to past where he will see all the characters of summertime saga game uh, in their young ages or he will time travel and he will go in future and he will see all the characters in their old age. But this theory is not going to be possible as for that the game creator have to make all the places and the characters in their old ages and young ages so that is not going to be possible. Now let's talk about the second theory. The second theory is going to be like this uh, Miss Okita and main character will put any character in that machine and that character will uh, come back in their old ages or in their young ages and I think this theory is possible as we have to just put a character inside that machine and then we have to feed the year if we want to see that character in their young age then we have to feed the year and then the character will come back in their young ages and this is possible as in the game there are many mid-aged characters like Debbie, Diane and there is also an old age character we know Miss Rose and we have seen a lot of scenes with her and many of you don't like so guys let me know in the comment section if you like scenes with Rose or not and also guys if you don't know let me tell you that she was very pretty in her young age if you haven't seen her young uh, photo then let me tell you how you can watch that photo you have to just go to hospital and then we have to go and talk with miss rose as we can see and here we have to check out her schedule she says that she will leave the desk in case of emergency so let's make a call let's go to the second floor and then we have to make a call and then she will leave her desk so that we can check out her photo and also we can take the keys so let's go back again as we have made an emergency call let's go to the first floor then to the desk and here we have to click here and here we can see keys and at bottom we can see there is a photo so when we click on it we can see young rose so you can see how the cute or we can say pretty the rose used to look in her old ages and also main character is saying that it's 1932's photo and she was very foxy as we see the young rose looks very pretty so many of you are thinking that if we could have uh, scenes with young rose 
so i guess this theory is going to be possible by this time machine if we put this old rose inside this time machine and also in game the main character says that the photo is of 1932 so if we fit 1932 in that time machine then the young rose will come back and then we could have a scene with her so let's see if this theory is possible i think this theory will be possible as dc has already added the photo of young rose and also we have seen uh, the photo of Diane and Debbie in their old school or we can say in their young ages as you can see. So by this in future we might put Diane or Debbie inside that time machine and we will see young Diane and Debbie and then we could have a new scenes with them in their young ages. Let's see in the future update if it is possible then there will be much more fun to see a young Debbie, Diane and Rose in their young ages. So guys let me know in the comment section what do you think and also if you haven't liked the video make sure to like the video and also subscribe our channel to watch more videos like this. I will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.